Hello oh guys, what is up? Gaming Horizon here, back with another video and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. So today I'm going to be doing a tutorial video on how to put your mod into Minecraft and how to like get it all installed and like how to put in mods into Minecraft. So the reason I'm doing this video is because I saw on my last video, like um, my older video, my um how to put in maps into t launcher video it's got like 1.8 k views and it also got like 54 likes so pretty good so i want to do like um another video that was like that but it now it's not t launcher it's using the actual minecraft launcher and also um guys the reason that i wasn't subscribed i mean the reason why i wasn't uploading i have what has ha oh my god i can't talk now the reason why i didn't upload on monday was because i was like pretty sick i wasn't feeling well actually so i just didn't upload because like i had to get some rest and stuff i had like a really bad headache and stuff but now i'm all good so it's all good guys so good so and i also got a new mouse i got the um steel series a rocks 3 wireless so it's a wireless mouse um i don't know if you guys can see it but it's right here the wireless mouse guys it has like um some pretty cool rgbs it has like a honeycomb design it's really light white mouse it's really good mouse got it for like 135 australian dollars because it was on like the black friday sale but if you guys get it um in normal price, like the normal price is 190. It's pretty pricey, but it's a pretty good mouse. It's really good actually. So I recommend you guys buying it. But without further ado, let's get right into the video. So first of all, what you're gonna do is open your web browser and then you're gonna search up Forge Download. After you search up Forge Download, um, um, so basically, first of all, I just wanted to say that the mods that we're going to be like showcasing like the mod like the mod that we're going to be using is 1.17.1 .1. so like here if you have like a different version mod like usually when you go into like forge download they say what game version so here you can just select your game version but today i'm going to be using 1.17.1 .1 cuz basically like that's the mod i'm going to be using so it'll bring you into like this ad thingy just wait for this and once you've done that you can skip and it'll download it usually like says like this file can harm your computer or whatever just keep the file it's fine doesn't matter see keep it's because the file type is a jar file but whatever it's fine okay so once you've done that you basically want to go to where it got downloaded you need to do double click and it'll like come up with like those things it'll come up with this but before that if um double clicking won't open it what you guys want to do is go into java download it's probably because you guys don't have java so you basically just go here just download java and follow the prompts and everything and you should be good to go guys so once you get here you click on install client and you just press ok and then when you press OK, it basically installs all of the game libraries and everything. But I don't need to do that, guys, because I already installed it. So um, after you've installed it, you basically want to open up Minecraft, your launcher. I'm using the new and improved Minecraft launcher. I'm using the launcher, which has like bedrock and stuff. So it's all in one. So it's pretty good. It's the new launcher. It's really good it's free like the new launcher but you still need to buy minecraft obviously okay so we'll wait for this to load and um once you've basically downloaded forge and you've done everything correctly um this forge thing should pop up so you basically just click on it and then we need to download our mod so the mod that we're going to be using is the world edit mod so it says 1.17.1 .1. that's why i'm using forge version 1.17.1 .1. so what you want to do here is you basically just download and it'll begin downloading in just a sec it should begin downloading yep it's loading it's right there just press keep 
doesn't actually harm your computer. It just assumes that it harms your computer because it's weird. Chrome is weird. Okay, so now when you've downloaded your desired mod and your um desired version of Forge, which goes with the mod, you basically go to installations and then hover your um version of Forge. And also, 1.18 just got released like a couple days ago. So you guys should check that out. It's really good. Okay, so um, 1.17. So here you want to click on this folder button. So once you've clicked on it, basically get your mod. So right click, downloads, get your mod, drag it on there. And then you basically have to scroll down all the way. Not all the way actually. And then find this mods folder. It looks a lot like the um T launcher thing but this is actual minecraft so some stuff might be a bit different so you click on the mods i know they have world editor in there so i'll just delete that um yeah i'll just delete that so once you're inside of the mods folder basically just get your file and you just drag it in once you've dragged it in everything should be good to go guys also i have a quick announcement so basically um i have some really good news so some of my videos that were laggy such as the tensura mod might not be laggy anymore and like my video quality might be a bit better because um i finally got my armory creator software to work and also um this whole time obs and minecraft was running on my um ryzen integrated graphics which is absolutely bad so i changed it so it would run on my gtx 1650 ti so that's all for the announcement so once you put the mod in you can close um file explorer and then you can go back to your minecraft launcher and all you want to do is click play for you guys there might be like a little download thingy like over there like a download thingy just wait for it to download it usually takes around two to five minutes but if you're on bad wi-fi it can take a long time because i'm on um i'm on i'm on lan i'm on 5g yeah i'm on 5g so it's pretty fast it's really fast yeah okay so once you've got into the game everything is normal except you guys will see like a little mod thing over here wait for it to load yeah so right here you'll see a little mod thing right there and that so it says three mods loaded um three mods loaded doesn't matter because there's like normal minecraft and forge those are considered mods for some reason but we welded it that's really important so now once you do that basically just go single player and then i already created a world so we'll go into that world and once you go into the world, the mod should be working unless the mods um like world edit, you just need to do like slash slash one, just like um this, you just need to do slash slash one and the mod works. But some other mods you might have to do like some other stuff, like actually like craft the items. So if for other mods like not like world edit and stuff i recommend going to like their wiki page because usually the wiki page has a lot of information so you guys should go to the wiki page okay okay so i don't know if this is lagging for you guys but yeah okay so now we're all good it's pretty smooth okay so now what i'm going to do is test out world edit for like proof that it actually works okay so we're gonna delete a whole entire thing now i'm gonna make a whole entire thing into lava so i'm gonna go there up to that tree because that's the highest point i'm gonna set it as lava okay so what you want to do is slash slash set Ooh, biome set biome 
Set it to the beach. Oh no, I think it might, it might lag. Plans were changed. Okay, look at this. Let's hope it works. Okay, let's hope it works. If it doesn't work, I'll do something else. Also, guys, um, we're so close to 100 subscribers. We're on 91 subscribers, guys. We just need nine more subs, and I'll be able to get 100 subscribers. So that's um, 100 subscribers is our first like milestone, I guess. So when we get to 100 subscribers, I'll be doing a 100 subscriber special video which will be a surprise but i've made up my mind on what i want the video to be and i hope you guys will like the 100 special video because it's gonna be good because we're celebrating my 100 subscribers accomplishment okay so okay so done so okay so proof to work i'm gonna be doing slash slash set lava Wait, should I, should, should I do lava? Okay, I'll do lava. Oh my god. It affected 1.1 million. You can see like smoke. 1.1 million. Um. Well, something is happening. Crashed my game. Okay, slash slash. Oh no, guys. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. What did I just do? Okay. Holy! Look at this! Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm not, I'm gonna undo it all. I'm gonna see what happened to like all the trees. The reason why I'm doing this is because to make the video longer and more entertaining. <laughs> so yeah. Oh no, it's not undoing. Um, okay. Oh, it's lagging. Oh, it's lagging. Just lagged a bit. Oh, you lagged right there. Oh! It's a lava wall. Wait a minute. Nothing got affected by the lava. The trees didn't burn. Jeez, okay. There's water everywhere. This is actually pretty cool. Okay, so I'm gonna do slash slash set TNT and then I'll set the whole thing on fire and I'll end the video there, guys. Oh, it's gonna be so laggy. Mm, where's the TNT? Oh, holy! This set, this brings me back. This sets nostalgic vibes when I used to do this. All the time. Oh, guys, I, the TNT is already blowing up because the TNT went on the lava. Because some of the lava, it like didn't um disappear. I don't know if you guys can still hear me, but because most of the not lava didn't disappear because like um because um so basically the lava didn't disappear because that wasn't from like the actual thing. It was just because like. The thing like overflowed and stuff so that was the lava okay guys um i'm gonna close minecraft okay it's lagging guys oh it just crashed it crashed okay it crashed it crashed <laughs> we crashed the game let's go we accomplished our goal to crash the game okay guys i think i'm gonna end the video there thank you guys for watching i hope this tutorial helped you guys a lot and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Get me to 100 subscribers as quick as possible because there's going to be a surprise. And thank you guys for watching. Make sure to get this video to as many views and likes as the 
how to put your map into a tea launcher video and if you guys do well then good for you good for you and i might also be doing some giveaways and stuff in the future maybe so thank you guys for watching and goodbye